Hi, this is Tola. I'm a local foodie. I'm from Asheville, North Carolina. For those of you who don't know, there's a very unique place that's in Asheville. It's called the Biltmore Village. It sits right outside the Biltmore State. So of course, just like what my everyday motto or mission is, I want to eat. So I'm looking for food. And I find this place called Fig. I didn't even know it was there. It's right on the outskirts of the village. And of course, I'm going to go venture in and figure this place out. And apparently Fig stands for food is good. You can't beat that. So of course, I'm gonna go in. And as soon as you walk in, the ambiance, you're just welcomed. It's this smaller place that you wouldn't expect to be there. And the staff is immediately welcoming and warm towards you. You sit down and experience with something else. The first thing we eat is this butter with these thinly sliced radishes on top. And it was perfectly sculpted in a way I didn't want to touch it because it was so pretty, but I had to because I was hungry. <laughs> and so I start putting the pieces of the radish and, and these amazing salts and, and spices that were on top, the butter onto the bread that was given to us and it melted in my mouth like you can't even imagine. So finally, once that was done, next we had this pork braised shoulder and this apple cider and it had an apple cider reduction on top of a celery root puree and some leeks and some apples and whenever you think of pork you think of the savory and the sweet I'm telling you what this dish had that perfect balance and as soon as I smell the aromas I start thinking about home because those scents reminded me of pho which is very interesting to me but those flavors have my heart. And so of course, this dish was a winner for me. Next we have this rock shrimp risotto. And it was just flavorful and creamy, just the way you would imagine it to be. Uh, with some leeks and this amazing sauce, it was perfectly blended together. And then finally, oh, he brought out this dessert and immediately I was like, that's a poached pear, isn't it? Because it is beautiful. <laughs> sure enough, this poached pear and this wine sauce, and it was, Placed right on top of mascarpone cheese, which is one of my favorites because tiramisu is a, something I always order when I go out. But here it was in a different form with a poached pear and these pieces of pistachio and this fig re balsamic reduction. Absolutely amazing. And you had to take every little piece into each bite because essentially it just melted as it went down. And I can't even begin to tell you how that was the perfect ending to my experience at that restaurant. So if you're ever visiting the Biltmore State, come to the Biltmore Village area. If you want a little bit more culture, this is definitely the restaurant you want to try.